them to let the oil cool down for about five or 10 minutes since they experienced the air. Ask them to go over to the fryer, open the door, and then on the right hand side of the control panel near the timer, or about in this general area, have them follow it all the way down under the drain handle. And just to the right of it is going to be a red reset switch. Tell them to push this up. They should feel it click into place. And then once they push it up and down, it should be a little spongy going up and down. That should reset the E10. If not, go ahead and schedule service at that time for a technician to check out the time, the uh, high limit probe. Thanks. to whichever vat is experiencing the E10 high limit, open the door under that vat, and there will be a black rocker switch located right on the ceiling in the front of, uh, by the control panel. Go ahead and press that rocker switch in. It should reset the E10 high limit on the fryer. Now, they do need to wait for the oil to cool down, so we recommend telling them to wait about five to 10 minutes since they experienced the error code coming over and trying to reset with the rocker switch. If it's unsuccessful, go ahead and schedule service for a technician to go out and see if it's something wrong with the actual probe.